Yeah, it's going to be hard. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ah, at least Alex qualified. Now we know! I have ever seen. I really like it. It's fast and fun and lots of good little corners and stuff. So I think it's pretty fun. It's fast. First look, I'm impressed. I mean, it looks like they've laid it out really well and I like this finishing stretch here. This looks like it's going to be open for some good stuff. How you doing, Dasha? All right. I think it's going to be carnage, yeah. Broken poles, yeah. Uh, like some corners, if you don't, if you catch an edge, you can wipe out and like take people out because the corners are so fast. You got some major air on the on the bridge. Yeah. At the top. Yeah. If you, like, you like bump off and then <laughs> go back in. Yeah, for sure. Oh, it's gonna be good. It's a uh, really cool venue for this, and yeah, it's gonna be super exciting. Tight, tight course. <laughs> course is good. Yeah, it's uh, it's fast out there. It's it's icy. It's fast. It's gonna be really tight and turny. Hopefully, we don't uh, we don't take any wipeouts out there. We gotta stay on our feet. You got a sag, yeah? Just wanna nice to see you, bud. We're going to talk about the order for tomorrow for the entry. Yeah. Do you want to go last? Sure. What do you think? What were you thinking, Justin? Yeah, I mean, it's up to you guys really on this one. Like, yeah. whatever you guys feel most comfortable with. I, I, I'll go. Yeah, okay. I, think I mean, that's like, good. I feel comfortable trying to, like, keep a good spot and, like, keep it in it. Okay. And then, like, you've had more experience with the type of speed and, like, the way things shake down at the end. Yeah. yeah we'll talk about it tonight. Like, I don't think there's much, you don't have to try and pass people the first couple laps, like, yeah. you're just going to waste energy. Yeah. Like, it's going to be kind of slow through there, and yeah. you should just sit in and enjoy yourself, like, yeah. and then here they're just going to, like, it's like go crazy. I think we pass in the transition. You've got to be probably careful of it, just make sure you're not so far back that there's a crash, yeah. 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 that you're going to get stuck yeah. behind. That's okay. the only big danger on these really windy. I think the transition, though, if we, like, nail those and have, like, last year Drew and I passed, like, that's where we pass people. We yeah. Okay. We just got like two or three teams yeah. every transition. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be good. That'll be good. Yeah, no, okay. I'm really excited. Sweet. Yeah, good. Okay. Cool. That's a gorgeous course out there. I mean, really fun. Really exciting. Dash and I are just like using all of our willpower to like stay calm. We're so freaking pumped. <laughs> She's like, I just want to race right now. And I'm like, tomorrow. <laughs> Okay. You guys all know it's the same course, men and women, two laps. Each athlete does two laps three times. Pretty strict. Always remember, so it's a hand to some part of the body, not hand to hand for the tag, okay? Course measured out to exactly 1.58 kilometers. Um, we were doing it in, not that we were fast, but we were trying hard. Were you the celebrity too? No. Uh, in 140. We made it 40. No way. One lap. One lap. One lap. Well, we did, we did, we did, two, we did three ten. course, three ten zone yeah. three. So we were thinking like high twos, low threes. Yeah. Oh yeah. Um, they're gonna modify the jump, so, and then send us a text to let us know if they keep it in there or not. So we'll forward that to you, but you'll see it. You'll see it as you're warming up. But they they want to have it more so it's like you're not going up, and then so it's like flat and with a drop. So you just kind of go in. Bring your tails. You keep it, they should just keep it closer, like down, so you have more speed. And yeah. yeah. But it's in just, a pad because you have yeah. bad time. Yeah. You're skating there. So we'll have someone here to look out after this, yeah. but. Um, there was a broken pole at T2. Yeah, there yeah. was. Yeah. T1's tight, too. Yeah. They're all good. <laughs> They're all good. <laughs> Sector one. <laughs> um, the thing is, we did the same. We are using the same amount of power every time. But just trying different lines. So this was probably the fastest line that we recorded of all of them. So it put Eric at almost 10 meters per second at the bottom of the hill. 
which was almost okay, half a meter a second faster well, than at I was ever yeah. at, at any time. Yeah, and then when I was also wide, I was faster than when I was narrow. Okay. So we really think like the wide line there could potentially be good, but again, you got to use it the right way as you're yeah. coming around that last part before the bridge. So again, this is Eric in the black pants, yeah. his yeah. line. And there I try to stay tight and, and, you get kind of and I get kind of pinched. Even though I come out ahead, Eric Pat comes up and starts oh, no. to pass me over the yeah. bridge. Oh, he almost fell. But, <laughs> <laughs> but it showed that the so speed was higher. So, so what, I guess what the takeaway is from this is really don't, I don't think it's super fast on that. You can stay tight along the fence until up towards the top, and then it's okay to like let it drift a little bit to the left, to skier's left, around there. And then Just the big again. thing is... Start again. So as you're coming up the hill, like, can you back it up, Sam? Yeah. Just to the... Um, yeah. Okay, this so corner, So you can yeah. be along this fence yeah. tight, yeah. but when you get to this point... It's it, top it, flat section. Yeah, yeah, it's better to let it go wide here and then really dive into this downhill with yeah, a lot yeah. of pulling. You see, I was even pushing there, but yeah, my yeah. speed wasn't... I, yeah. I couldn't do it because it was, it was just the way it is. You just, yeah. So I really think in the warm-up, try that section and just feel, see how wide it is, how yeah. comfortable you were. Someone's not going to like ace yeah. you too bad. Yeah. But I think if you're in the lead, or if you're not in the lead, you can go wide yeah, and have confidence yeah. that you're going to, even if you're even with them going over the top, you're going to have more speed over the bump, which is going to translate all the way down. Okay? okay? That's awesome. So... I feel pretty, I think that's a pretty important part of the race, especially in the final. So that's when you're really, if you're the person that's coming in, when you feel 100% confident that no matter how fast they take off, you can get them, mm -hmm. that's when I think you, cool. you tell them to go. And that's what I, I know you guys were doing today. Yeah. Like, yeah. But it can be loud, too, but yeah. you just yell, like, go, and they, they'll hear you. Like, yeah. And that's the sign, I think that's the best, is just double pull yeah. super hard. Yeah at that point mm -hmm. and try to keep it pretty tight. Don't worry about winning the race in the, the tag zone, but you could break a pole and potentially lose the race or miss the tag. I mean, those, so just nice, safe, clean tags. Cool. But I think if the person is behind really has the vision, it can tell how, how, yeah, gauge that. Yes. how to gauge that. Okay, cool. So I'll try to, try to do some of those. Yeah. Stay clean, get in the finals, then keep it cool and remember it's about coming across the finish line that last that last lap pretty much so okay good thanks guys thanks for that um, thanks for flying on a red eye and then hammering all day i love it man <laughs> feel good <laughs> actually sorry guys from my window and i'm like wow going for it we were going for it dad's it wasn't pretty Jeez. all right Sweet. Let's pick up some guys. Hot dogs. Oh, <laughs>